Hello, my name is Seng Yanni, CEO of b s e n g Inc. Today, I would like to talk about 3D Super NAND versus other 3D NANDs, functionality and reliability comparison for technology savvy. I explained how 3D Super NAND could achieve 10 times better cost advantages over other 3D NANDs with 10 times better wafer throughput and 10 times less fab investment. If you missed this video tutorial, please check the following video on YouTube. In this video tutorial, functionality and reliability will be compared. Okay, it is well known that 3D NAND has better functionality and reliability compared to planar NAND. Program and erase of 3D NAND run about twice faster, and power consumption of 3D NAND is about twice less than that of planar NAND. Also, it has better endurance and enables more bit per cell. These advantages mainly come from large surrounding gate of 3D NAND, which controls about 25 times more gate charges compared to small planar NAND gate. Therefore, instead of two-step program and erase for planar NAND, one step is good enough for 3D NAND. In the market, 3D NAND-based SSD is about 50% more expensive than planar NAND-based SSD, though the demands on 3D NAND-based SSD is high because of better functionality and reliability. Here is comparison of gate control to charge. If we assume the gate area equals to the gate control charge, then 3D NAND has about 25 times more gate charges compared to 50 nanometer planar NAND. In this comparison, the diameter of 3D NAND is about 30 nanometer and the height of gate is 53 nanometer. 3D Super NAND has 35 times more gate charges, 20 nanometer diameter and high aspect ratio of gate control more gate charges. Based on gate control charge, we could figure out that 3D Super NAND has fast program and erase speed, low power consumption, and better endurance compared to other 3D NANDs. In addition, we need to consider gate electric field. Planar NAND has uniform gate electric field. However, in case of surrounding gate, small diameter has higher gate electric field and therefore, it shows fast program and erase speed. In other words, low voltage could be used for program and erase for small diameter, and accordingly, power consumption will be small. Cell-to-cell -cell interference negatively affect functionality and reliability of NAND flash memory. Some people claim 3D NAND is free from cell-to-cell -cell interference. In fact, the distance between gate charges of 3D NAND is closer than that of 15 nanometer planar NAND. Also, the interference area of 3D NAND is larger, though gate control charge of 3D NAND is much bigger than that of planar NAND. So, 3D NAND does not have to concern about cell-to-cell -cell interference. In case of 3D Super NAND, the distance between gate charges is about 20 nanometer, and the interference takes place along the line. So 3D Super NAND is free from cell-to-cell -cell interference. Fresh memory is all about how to control gate charges. So it is important to understand gate control charges and cell-to-cell -cell interference. We may consider the gate control charge as signal and the interference as noise. Then, signal-to-noise ratio could be compared as shown in this slide. The numbers are not exact, but relative comparison among three different cell structures. Certainly, 3D Super NAND has much higher signal-to-noise ratio compared to 3D NAND. Higher S and ratio means better functionality and reliability of NAND flash memory. 
I discussed about gate control charge, gate electric field, cell to cell interference, and signal to noise ratio of gate control charge. There is another important consideration when we discuss about functionality and reliability of NAND flash memory. It is material quality. 3D NAND successfully utilizes polycrystalline silicon for the high density memory cells for the first time in the semiconductor industry. It is a big achievement in terms of engineering of material. TFT cannot be compared with 3D NAND. Same film transistor has been used for a long time. However, TFT is a much, much bigger device with thick gate oxide. However, polysilicon has very low carrier mobility and therefore very low current driving capability compared to single crystalline silicon. The difference is orders of magnitude. In addition, non-uniform grain boundary of polysilicon causes non-uniform distribution of NAND flash functionality and reliability within a wafer and among wafers. So 3D Super NAND should be much better in terms of functionality and reliability compared to other 3D NAND because of the difference of material quality. According to measured data, 3D Super NAND shows about 3 times better functionality and about 10 times to 100 times better reliability compared to other 3D NANDs. The difference comes from gate control charges, gate electric field, cell to cell interference, and material quality. That's it for today. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to share this video tutorial.